So we found Medlife, uh, my girlfriend actually found them online. Uh, we were just looking for pre, pre-lockdown for surgery in Turkey. Uh, and then it, it obviously went into lockdown, the whole situation changed. And then coming out the other side, we decided to look outside of Istanbul, because everywhere was Istanbul, and then came to Izmir, which is a lot quieter and a little bit nicer um, to, to come to for a bit of a destination. And it had really good reviews for Medlife, so it's why we obviously went with them for reviews from TripAdvisor, something like this, and other places that we could find, because, you know, obviously it's a, it's a, a surgery, it's, it's not something we wanted to just go into blindly. The opportunity came up, we booked it, paid for it, and then we were coming up, coming here, and it didn't really seem real until we got in and, the, and the, I met the surgeon, and he's going through the consultation and drawing on me and things, and I started to get quite quite scared, if I'm honest, because um, I, I was realising what a big operation it actually was. And then when when obviously we went through through into surgery quite fast, so everything was quite quick. It wasn't like I was sat in a hospital bed waiting for hours, which is often the case. It was quite quick from from getting to the hospital, obviously getting brought from the hotel by, by Medlife to the hospital. They stayed with us um, and the guys obviously they were really really friendly, which made us feel a bit more comfortable as well. And their English obviously is very good, which was a massive a massive factor. Everything went through and it was, it was fine. And I, I felt I was just feeling quite scared. The surge actually helped me feel a bit more relaxed, kind of just making jokes and stuff to, to make me feel a bit calmer, which is a big thing because obviously we're in a different country. It is a little bit kind of scary. You know, you hear these horror stories of, bad operations abroad and stuff like that, but it's not been that at all. It's been a nice, a nice experience. As nice as it could be for what I've actually had done. Um, which, this isn't the most, the nicest thing, if I'm honest. <laughs> it's, it's quite painful, and I, did, and I did underestimate that. But it's, it's been made, like I said, as nice as, as, nice as it could be. Um, it made it good that we could communicate with people back and forth all the time. And then I obviously went to a surgeon yesterday, got the tubes removed they're draining tubes in first and that was that was one of the worst things because every time I moved or sat down you were sat on the tubes or knocking them and there was a lot of pain from them since they've been removed it's not been as bad obviously I felt a lot more comfortable and then you know, it, he, he explained everything further I mean overall it's been quite a pleasant experience like I said it's pleasant as it could be for having a big operation done uh, but it, it, it's been it, it's been quite nice yeah, obviously we met some other people as well, there's a lot of people around the pool and at the other hotel that were also having surgeries done. And everyone's been quite open about it, talking, okay, oh what have you had done, what have you had done? Because obviously if you see someone with the draining tubes in the hands, <laughs> you're obviously it's quite clear that I've had something done. Um, and people are just discussing it and quite open. Um, and I think it, it, made, it real, made us all realise that it's a bit more normal to come, come on holiday, get some surgery done, if it's something that genuinely makes you unhappy and if it's affecting your life because that's what everyone was saying it's you know it's something that's for me it was affecting my life and it was something like mine was a, a tummy tuck which people said I, I wouldn't think you'd, you'd want that because it was something that was intimate to me that no one else knew so it was just coming over here getting it done and with somewhere we could, we could actually trust as well which is the main thing the results are hard to see right now I can see it's going down day by day and the, oh, I've got a corset thing on which is going I'm getting tighter and tighter each day so you can see it's getting a lot smaller and there's a smaller one to wear after that so you can see that it's the areas come down but it's also hard to see at the same time just because of how I came I said my, my, I, I, I was told that if you're leaner the opposite operation more successful so I came quite lean and you could see my abs and there was just the more sort of skin was the problem and a little bit of body fat around around the edge of my lower back so right now that area is still quite inflamed, but it'll go down each time. Like I said, it's been going down day by day and it'll continue to go down for the next few months, the surgeon said. Um, like I said, when, once he ex explained it a bit more, I felt a little bit more settled. The fact that he said, just keep that on, it keeps getting it tighter and tighter. Go back to your normal diet, because obviously my normal diet is, is one that's high in vegetables, high in meat and things like that. And, um, he said, exercise when you can, but don't really, he said, just leave it for a few weeks and obviously be careful and I've got to listen to my body and do, do it when I can. If you're scared and not wanting to come abroad to get surgery done because you're f fearful that it, it's not a, a clean practice, it's, it's not um, the same conditions as the UK or anything like that, it's not true at all. Um, coming over here was, 
like I said, we've met a lot of people and everyone's had a pleasant experience to tell. No one's had horror stories like we are sort of fed in the UK. It's just it's simply not the case. Um, the surgeries over here are exactly the same. You could, the only way you could tell it wasn't an English hospital was the fact people speak a different language. It was exactly the same. And like I said, we felt completely comfortable with the staff that were treating, treating us quite well. Thank you Medlife for a fantastic surgery. I'm very happy with the results, although I can't quite see them all yet. But I know it's coming down with time and it's changing day by day. Uh, and I, just, I appreciate obviously everything that's been done by the staff and, and by obviously everyone through the phone as well. It's been a fantastic experience and I'd, I'd definitely recommend it to other people and potentially come again for something else. <laughs>